Hello, hello. Welcome back to some more Umineko and they cry. Hmm. Oh, uh, hopefully the mic is a bit more adjustable. Usually, until I can get like a proper like a like a phone filter for the headset, you know, that is what it's gonna be. You know. So where we last left off, other than you know, the two Bietos were. I'm having a little conversation on how to actually convince um, humans whether magic is real or not. You know, the rest of the, um, the part that I uh, that I already went that I looked through, and because I, I normally just look back and rewatch some of the parts just to see what what I missed. There was nothing really important, like Erica. Picking a fight with Maria, and I don't even know if that's even important or not. It doesn't really feel important to me. It just makes Mar it just makes Erica show how how much of an ego she has, and she's power hungry in the way she is. Like they written her to be hateable, in which, like, I get the feeling that's how the sixth episode will turn out. And well. It's not to mention, it's like... Her character... The way she acts reminds me of a YouTuber... Who is power hungry... And any sort of critique just, you know... This is it. This is a mob for her. Which, whatever you could prefer. But... Yeah. I mean, that was about it. I mean... I mean, it already shows that... Dal even Dalinar and... And the... Uh, couple of her assistants are like already they're, I mean they're already aware of her behavior so um I don't know I guess I, it's gonna be one of those moments if Erica ever keeps us up and it's gonna bite her in the ass later on so but yeah that's about it let's uh, continue reading oh by the way my my out my um symptom is uh, getting better my allergies and such it's, I don't know, it's usually... It usually, like, reacts pretty differently when it depending on the, the weather or the temperature as such. Although, which is weird because, like, I'll, I'll be at work and then my allergies get worse, but if I'm at home, it's, like, fine. I don't know, it's like a, maybe it's a more of an indoors thing. I guess it varies on seasons, though. So. Anyway. Don't mean to be a. Uh, don't, don't mean to derail. So. Erica and the others turned their backs on Maria, was still crouching down limp. However, as detectives and famous mysteries have always done in the past, Erica clapped her hands, stopped, and turned around. So so. Oh right, I, I forgot how, how petty she was when it comes to the whole candy thing. <laughs> ただカップが伏せてあるだけで、フルドエリカはこの程度の推理が可能です。いかがです、皆様方？Erica's <笑> merciless words gouged themselves into Maria's heart once more. left, leaving an evil laugh behind her. After bowing to Maria and Sakutaro, Dalinor left too. Gertrude and Cornelia followed suit. After that, only Maria and Sakutaro were left in the lonely golden land. Ma 
法だよベアとは魔法でマリアにキャンディーをくれたんだよ疑わなくていいんだよウリュウベアトを信じてあげて魔法は信じなくちゃ実らないってマリアは知ってるよ Surrounded by an ice cold drizzle that had started falling at some point, Maria quiet, cried quietly. Trying to at least protect her from the rain, Sakutaro used his large sleeves to cover Maria's head and stayed her by her side. Go, Maria! Let's go to the top of the house. エリカさん僕は今のやり取りはあまり大人として尊敬できないねどうもすみません私もまだ子供なものでまあエリカは、まあ、私は子供なものでまあエリカは子供なものでエリカさんの部屋用意があるそうだからシャノン案内してあげてまだ結構です私はもう少しここでのんびりすることにします余韻を楽しみたいのでなんの余韻だよ。バドラーと他の人は、彼らの余韻を持つことができない。彼らの余韻を持つことができない。彼らの余韻を持つことができない。彼らの余韻を持つことができない。彼らの余韻を持つことができない。彼らの余韻を持つことができない。彼らの余韻を持つことができない。彼らの余韻を持つことができない。Jessica urged Maria, who was still crying, to come along. Then Maria stopped and spun around. Nanika? Hmm? Tama ni irunda 
よ魔法を信じない毒素の塊みたいな人間がいや、that is the weird part, right? So, so what Erica, so Erica's behavior made her more of a piece of shit. However, is Maria's like crying? Is Maria crying a part of mini, like a a, minty, a manipulation bait? That's kind of that's the thing, though, right? Watashino class, ni mo, omae mitai na danshi ga ikura demo iru yo. Lots of boys, like you. Oh, she's comparing Erica to like the those the stu her her classmates and. Majo mo maho mo kiseki mo shiyawase mo nani mo shinji na. Sonna teedo no yatsura no dokuso ni yakarete hai ni natchau yo ja majo ni nanka wa nare nai ne. You know, that's like the one kid in class that believes in Santa, and then, and then the rest of the people around him in school just bully him for that. So. Maria, I can't see it, but Beatrice is the best. Kenshin is a monster. Hahaha! Hahaha! Maria, who had been crying quietly a second ago, seemed to have been transformed into an, an entirely different person. She laughed. No, cackled here. Battler's group stiffened up at this sudden change, but Erica was watching calmly. Then she smiled and gave a small nod in response. <laughs> what the fuck? I show a lot of canidas. Miss Maria? Sugi wa motto te gotai ga aru game de tatakai masho. Is this some kind of warm up? I, I am gonna. If that's some kind of warm up, that's actually kind of fucked up kind of warm up, warm up there, though. That's like using tough. That's like a tough love type of、uh, strategy. So da ne. So shi yo ne. Yakusoku shi yo. This is so weird. Ma Maria, mo yosette. Iko iko. No, le no, no, let let her cook. Shannon chan mo do. Yo katta ra issho ni Trump. Trump. Hon mo issen demo ii kara tsukiyatte kure ya. Yakubarai ni naru ze. Shannon couldn't remain in this suffocating lounge any longer either. In part apologetic and in part trying to escape, she followed after Battler's group. After that, Erica was the only one left in the lounge. Still wearing a thin smile, she tapped the glass with her finger. There was a light. Clink, chink, and the surprisingly boring sound. Even so, Erica wore a thin smile, as though pleased. Ha 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 ha! Oh, matase しました。お風呂に入っておりまして。What the? I didn't even. I didn't even know Kumasawa was. Oh yeah, 皆様方は。入れ替わりですね。ついさっき二階へ上がりました。あなたを呼んだのは私です。何でも悪事記島の話や森の魔女の話などにも詳しいとか。ええー、まあ。<笑>たわいもない話ですが。It's a trivial story, however. たいなくて大いに結構です。湯上がりに一杯いかがで。私もたまにはサービスくらいしますので。Oh wow, she can be part of service. Why am I not surprised? 
Erica stood up, opened the refrigerator behind the counter, and put ice into the ice pail. And, okay, well, it ended just like that. I'm pretty sure they're not going to have an interesting conversation. So, what a ridiculous 15 minutes in. Jesus Christ. Uh, I know I ain't looking forward to this one. Chapter 6. Well, well, I guess, well, and <laughs> I don't know why I was hesitating. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure teenagers are meant to be shitheads, but you know. I'm pretty sure you're not a teenager unless you unless you hit your fucking mid twenties or some stu something stupid like that. I'm pretty sure. No, I'm. I'm I think President Sunday uh, got one dude uh, said some something similar or like, oh, you're you're you can't you are not a teenager until you hit your thirties or until you hit thirty or something ridiculous. I don't know. Oh, is this the? Oh, uh, we're going to, the, we're going through the same phase where the where George is gonna make a proposal, huh? George <laughs> But yeah, I think. Oh, but yeah, that's what the, this is what I was thinking. Like, I feel like Erica is being a, a complete asshole to everyone, mostly just to get back at Battler, considering that um, on episode six, you know, we already know that Battler is the fucking game master, you know, the endless sorcerer. So, is that George and Shannon could be seen standing in the rainy rose garden. Though the rain was still pouring down, there was hardly any wind at all. The scant protection provided by the arbor was more than enough to house this secret meeting between lovers. Following that fight with Erica, they had decided to play some cards for a change of pace. When that was over, Shannon had returned to the servant room, and shortly after that, George had left his room to meet with Shannon at the time they had arranged. Erica一番自分自身との付き合い方が難しいと思います。そうだね。子供という殻を打ち破りたくて、あたり構わず口端を打ちつける落とし頃だね。それを打ち破れてようやく大きく羽ばたくことができる。僕もそうだったよ。かつてまだ殻の中にいた時の自分は情けなくひ弱なまるで尊敬できない男だった。So you said you you're telling me that you you were you were being a little shithead. そそんなことはありません。It's wild. いやいいんだ。自分でもわかってる。かつての僕はいとこの中で最年長ではあってもいつもぼんやりしているうだつの上がらない男だったよ。Is this is this like is this part gonna derail into like I questioned like the ethics and morals of like do you think it's okay for Erica to be a or any sort of teenager to be a complete entitled asshole? <laughs> I hated being like that. I wanted to break that shell and become a splendid adult like mother and father. 
でもジョージ様はそれを打ち破られましたこの数年のジョージ様は毎年出会うたびに道があるようでしたありがとう何かきっかけがあったんですか殻を破るはいあれほどのまるでさなぎを経て蝶になるかのように目まぐるしく成長されたジョージ様がうんただ漫然と日々を過ごしていてそれを迎えられたとは思いませんそれだけの大きな決意をされる何かきっかけがあったに違いないと思いまして君に惚れて愛の力で成長したと僕は今まで言ってきたんだけど<笑>本当はもっとネガティブな感情からだったんだそんないつも明るく朗らかでおられるジョージさんにネガティブな感情なんてちょっと信じられないです。Oh boy, what kind of baggage are Jordan's gonna、uh, explain this time? Your son, you say, what I said, and she wrote, or she read it. So she said, so she said, 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 s Yeah, George seems to be a very. I don't know. It seems like George is a bit of a boring character, but he's like, because he's always too much of a nice guy. He's always like, you know, he wants to even it out with this sort of diplomacy within the family. Hmm? That's what I want to know. I said, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know. 過度に神格化して恐れて紳士的なレディーファーストを装いながら you defy them excessively hang on hang on uh defy as in like huh that's so weird So he treats women like they're, they're goddesses? That's a, that's a very interesting. That's a kind of a weird way for this guy, but. He it seems like George. Okay, so what you're telling me is George is a womanizer. Okay, he's, I don't think he's a womanizer, but he's like, he's really awkward. That type of thing. Of course, George had wanted to be around girls as much as any healthy boy might. However, he didn't know how to interact with them. He wanted to act like a gentleman to avoid being disliked by them, treating them with care. Of those feelings, only the words treat women with care took precedence. Uh. Blossoming into a subconscious fear of women. そんな男を紳士的な奥手な男と呼ぶんだろうねとんでもないただの臆病者さ you were just coward. そのくせ自分はこんなにも紳士的なのにどうして彼女ができないのかと一方的に思い込む最後には世間の女性はすべて男を見る目がないなんて勝手に決めつけ勝手に詐欺すみ始めこれが本当の情けない男ってもさ
he came you came to the conclusion that all the women in the world had no taste and started to hate all of them. So base Huh. So he went from like socially awkward and nice to uh being a incel. Is that what you're is that what you're telling me? I mean that's that is kinda what I'm getting from it, but I could be wrong. I don't know, man. Like, is all all I rem if I feel like he's like critiquing his own like socially awkward behavior to where he's like, oh, you know, like. But <laughs> I mean, not everyone can you uh, strike a conversation with uh, confidence, you know. How many years ago was it when I noticed? Probably when I was in middle school. At the time, I assumed that I was obviously the most gentlemanly of the cousins, so I would obviously be popular with Lyndon. However, reality was very different. At school, I was pretty much completely hopeless. Far from being a leader, I was a typical bullied kid who got pushed around by everyone. At the time, I figured I was just a capable and adaptable man who could keep in perfect tune with his surroundings. Well, man, school is always going to be harsh reality no matter what. How stupid. Sure, I might have gained some measure of trust from girls. However, not only are there no one that would become my girlfriend, there weren't even any girls I could call friends. So, yeah, so, so. Lady first to show she eats more, she does a girl to go there. So, now she don't know, Kane, you can know, to go on, and I can see the corner. That ain't a woman, Monica. Cocky, then. So, any kids, guys.自分は シャノンにもそういう経験がもちろんです。私だって男の子の気を引きたくてできもしないお化粧をして恥をかいたり。恥ずかしい失敗の思い出がたくさんあります。Embarrassing <笑> failures. そんな、うのぼれた僕の目を覚ましてくれたのがシャノン。いや、君たちだった。どんなきっかけがジョージさんに訪れたんですか<笑> Envy. Oh boy. You know, envy is a is a bit of a powerful emotion if you think about it. Also Jealousy and envy are similar definitions, but it really depends on like the scenario, you know. I wouldn't necessarily recommend um going around being envy or Shannon raced through her memories, trying to find a conversation that might have made George envious. 
君たちにとってはたあいない会話だったに違いないよでも僕はそれに嫉妬を感じてしまったここからの話はバトラ君には絶対に内緒にしてほしい約束できるももちろんです<笑>みすぼらしい僕の懺悔さでも聞いてほしい今夜は僕の悪い部分も知ってくれた上で君に返事をもらいたいことがあるからはい聞かせてください With a smile but a serious look in her eyes Cannon nodded Tonight she knew what he was going to ask her tonight George had the right to confess before asking that sacred question, and Shannon had the obligation to listen. Shannon understood this, so she listened quietly. <laughs> Featherine peeping、uh, on those two within confession? She finds the expression of the virgin disgust on Angie's face. <laughs> Oh, that. I, I ain't gonna lie, that. that's actually pretty funny. That's a, that's a pretty interesting call out there. <laughs> wow. I don't know. I don't. Th I doubt Angie has like any sort of like love interest. I mean, unless we're. Unless we count、uh, Amakusa, but Amakusa is just more of a bodyguard for Angie. Yeah, I can't really think of anything else. Featherine laughed quietly. I don't know. Like, if we're really. If, 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 when it comes to love stories, it, it usually. I don't know. Love stories are, can be, like, hard to write about because it's usually it takes, like, I don't know. There's a lot of scenarios. There are various. I mean, there are multiple scenarios you can think of and then a very certain amount of buildup that you can make. But a lot of times, like, Takes a lot of a confidential to it. Angie huffed and looked away, but she quickly realized that this would only entertain Featherine even more, so she tried to add unconcern. Batra kun mo Jessica chan mo, mukashi kara kaikatsu da ne. Ah, wait, did Angie、um, read out the part with the feud between Murray? Marie and Erica, or is this, you know, is this not part of the tale? I don't know. Both b a d l e r k u n and Jessica Chan have always been spirited. Yeah, so n y i k a t a wa t o r i t s u k u r o t t e r Dakara, k o y u y o George looked up at where the moon should be, high above the rain clouds, and spoke. They were honest words spoken simply from George's heart. You know, that's the thing, though, right? He talked about, George talked about the, his backstory for this episode, but it, it was never mentioned in like episode, in like, like, well, episode five didn't really partake in much, but episodes like maybe one to four, they, he never talked about his backstory. All he did was like his, his generic confession, and that's about it. So. They were honest words spoken simply from George's heart. Bokua Mukashkara Batora Kun Mo Jessica Chan Mo Legini Kaketa Kodato Motte Dio. Yeah, 
もっとダイレクトに言おう言葉遣いの下品な子たちだなとさえ思っていたよ本当さ軽蔑してくれていい Well, that's the thing with Adler and Jessica, right? Like, both of them got. I mean. Well, both got their flaws, right? But. Just, but. Do you think. Do you think the question is, like, just because both Adler and Jessica are teenagers, they. We can't. We can't, like, excuse their flaws? No, that's the thing. You know? It's kind of. I feel like when it comes to reading out a story and all the such, or, like, When you partake, like, the、um, listening to, like, someone, like, a person, like, it's always important to, like, point out the characteristics. So, yeah, I, I do believe Battler and Jessica do have its flaws. I'm not sure. 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 ありがとう<笑>僕はそんな彼らを内心見下していたよそれに比べて僕はなんと立派で紳士的魅力にあふれているかと本気でうぬぼれていたさ I was at that age where having a girlfriend felt like a necessary condition for becoming a real man I truly believe that no girl could fail to admire a gentleman who treated girls as well as I did. So, I really did assume that the girls I knew were attracted to me. So, I really did assume that the girls I knew were attracted to me. Hmm. You thought that Battler and Jessica, who always joked around and spoke in a rude, vulgar mash, would never be able to get a boyfriend or girlfriend? Well, so they got it's my detective, more Kanojo got the Kinai Jibun Edo. Say she and Tays, I got the Kamashirina. I mean, they're not at that time yet. I mean, I mean, Jessica already has her like love interest, which is with Canon, but it doesn't, re it doesn't really show until like later on. It was like, or like if it's already like when it's spoken out within true feelings, you know. And I don't know about Badler when it comes to his love interest. I mean, he, he does tease around with women. That's for, that's for, that's as far as I remember. But, um,. I mean, my theory could be with the witch, you know, like the original carrots and such, but, you know, we'll see. No, they don't. They don't want me to be a witch. 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 So、バトラもジェシカも昔からああいう性分だった確かにソヤで紳士的淑女的とは到底言えなかっただろうしかし男女を分け隔てなく交流できる力があったいや So, so, even if Valor and Jessica got like, you know, their weird, obnoxious behavior, they even did, so both got their own charm. So, so, same. Choto Wakarua Oni Tanya, Jessica on Echa Mita in a type no hitote, Danjo Toaz, Dareto de Monakayoko Nareto type yo, ne? ジョージお兄ちゃんには悪いけどあまり紳士を振りかざしすぎる人ってちょっと気持ち悪いわ女に幻想持ちすぎっていうかなんというか
<laughs> it's like it's like Verge is your Verge is trying too hard. Yeah, George is a very I don't know. I mean, most of George's character, but I mean, other than George is shown in battle. I mean, everything about George, you know, as a human, is just he's just boring. Also, what he also his backstory made him so fucking awkward too. ヒトは無縁であるなら相手が無害で退屈な人間であることを尊ぶ。ヘイユーゴ。しかしそれは邪魔にならないという意味で好まれているだけだ。退屈な人間を身近にしたいと願う人間など、いるわけもない。ダメ
君たちがバトラ君やジェシカちゃんと僕なんかよりはるかによく馴染んで楽しそうに遊んでいることに。Yes. Those two whom I had looked down upon so much were radiating far more charm than I was. You really looked like you were enjoying yourself that day. The look on your face was far brighter than any you ever showed me. ひょっとしたら異性の付き合いになってもいいかななんて青臭い白昼夢を許したことさえあるんだそれを勝手に恋人を奪われた気持ちになって勝手に傷ついてるどこまでも僕はダメな男だったんだ You were such a pathetic man It unfortunate on that part その時ようやく僕は自分の愚かさに気づけたんだ<笑> You sadly felt that your girlfriend was stolen from you and let myself feel hurt <笑> Oh it's your your I see you're so gorgeous like misinterpreting of like the situation at hand It's one of those moments, huh? Joji Sama. That's. I don't know, man. That's a. It's a bold. That's a bit of a bold way to put it. So, yeah. So, now, the battle is a little bit of a thing. The battle is a little bit of a thing. The battle is a little bit of a thing. The battle is a Hmm. Stuff happened. Ojisanもかわいい人だね。バトラ君とあんなにいつも喧嘩をしているのにバトラ君の近況を常に気にかけていた。そうですね。私も聞かせてもらったことがあります。Asumu. Could be. I mean, it could, it could be a part of his genes. I mean, that's the thing, right? Like. Like. I mean, a son and daughter, like, inherited, like, the、um, parents' behavior based on, based on genetics. I mean, it could be possible. Not saying it's, it's not true, but it can be a possibility. So, Jessica Chan, more. Danjo no Tomodachi, or all they could say, it's more so no chusin de Katsiakus Tiru to Ki Titashi. That she was always right. 実際ジェシカちゃんと話してもそれは何の誇張でもないと理解できたよ。あ、uh,、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなたは、あなた I mean, it's like that with episode two, so no, no big surprise. <coughs> Excuse me. This proved that the two I'd looked down upon were much more attractive to human beings than I was. I thought I was going to be able to do that. I'm going to be able to do that. I'm going to be able to do that. I'm going to be able to do that. 彼らのような魅力が得られると思い込んだ。Well, uh, yeah, but 
It doesn't work like that for everyone, though. <laughs> like, not like just because you can try to mimic that from like people you know does does not doesn't mean it's, you're going to end up with the same results as them. Excuse me. I can cough and decide to come back again. Uh, I wouldn't even want to picture that as well. That would be a little bit too awkward for my taste. Don't we all want to, like, find a way to go back in time and fix those cringy moments that you had done? Yeah, that was something that I... Like, like, the cousin, George and the cousins, are can be do dumb, can be dumb and do stupid shit at times. I had done stupid shit. So, I mean, can you really fault them for that? I mean, but, but it really depends.僕に魅力がないのは人を大事にすると称したり場の雰囲気に合わせて振る舞えると称したりしていつも一歩逃げている自分の臆病さにあったんだ僕はそれを克服するために生まれ変わる決意をしたよ初めて自分の殻というものを理解し、それを打ち破ろうと誓ったんだ。その意志がくじけそうになるたびに、あの日のことを思い出してバネにした。君たちが僕を忘れて楽しそうに遊んでいたあの日。そして。僕に好意があると決めつけている君の瞳に僕が映っていなかったことをね誓ったのよ今度こそ本当に君を振り向かせてその瞳に僕を映してやりたいとねそれが実は君に恋をした一番最初の感情複雑だったんですねあの日僕を無視して遊んでいた君たちいや君への復讐がで this desire for revenge uh that's a bit of a exaggerated wording isn't it いつの間にか本当の恋心に変わっていったんだ。What the fuck do you mean by your desire for revenge against the two of them who had ignored your plan? Like, what, what were you, what were you plotting before that, before that? しかし、神に誓うよ。You swear this to God? What? それが君のことを真剣に考え出したきっかけだとしても僕が今君に持つ気持ちには何の偽りもないうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんう
no matter like what whether no matter the opinions from from others in in his family so right Joji san Ijo ga kimi ni saki ni shite okita itzan desa Boku wa kyou made kimi no koto o hatsukoi de hitome bore datta to itte kita それは嘘なんだうぬぼれた僕の歪んだ selfish, 関係ないですそんなのシャンンスマイルドシスポークフォースフォリーエナフトカットゥジョージェスウォーズ初恋じゃなかったら結ばれちゃいけないんですか初恋の人を忘れたらそれは裏切りなんですか恋ってそんな単純じゃないい,いえ単純かもしれないだって恋なんて簡単常に今の今の自分の正直な気持ちだけが正解なのだからだから昔の話も慣れ初めも何も関係ないんです That's、uh, the rule saying that people can't get together just because they weren't each other's first look I mean <coughs> oh god excuse me I mean, I'm pretty sure there are like more rules and ethics when it comes to like, when it comes to love, but it's not always like, in, it's not really enforced on all scenarios. I mean, there are some, but, you know. It takes. Love really comes from like starting from the very first step at the mountain, you know? Zange, she's on that takana. What's wrong with him? Ee? Nagi got to more can't pick in a Joji Sangi mo. Ningen Ksai Ichimen got a cotton of a cate. Chotta Ureshkata des. Without love, the confessions could not be read. <laughs> yeah, well done. That's something to be expected. So, I was like, I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to 僕になれた私もジョージさんがいるから私でいるのですだから包み隠さず教えてください私たちはどんな夫婦になってどんな未来を築くのですか、uh, it's, a, it's, it's one of those things. The, the, the end result. 僕は君という妻を得て。What was a bit of a weird pause? The hell? 父さんを超える実業家になる。そして、さまざまな挑戦や冒険を経て、自分の可能性の限界を確かめたい。その到達点の頂に君と一緒に至りたいんだそこからの眺めは僕以外の誰にも見せられないものになる楽しそうですどこまでもお供しますもちろん実業家としての冒険だけじゃない
夫婦でしか気づけないものもたくさん積み上げていきたい<笑>それはどんなものですか子供を作ろう、wow. That was a bit. That was a bit direct there. Hi, Dana Sama. Saite, Sanin was good day. Otokonokomo, Onanokomo, Lioho Hoshi. That's a bit too much of a challenge there, but. Sure. Moshi. 3人とも男の子だったら Well, that's the thing, right? Like, you can't, like, when it comes to having. I mean, this is come. I mean, I don't know anything about when it comes to, like, procreation or, you know, making babies, but you can't really wish for everything. You can't make that wish like that to happen, you know? Tsugi go so, on nano ko kamo ne. Wait, 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 wait. He said three. He said he wanted to have at least three kids. You're telling, you're telling me she, he wants to have four. If, and then if it's going to be a fourth boy, then he's going to, then he's going to chance at another one. This is a 50 50 chance you're dealing with here. It doesn't matter how many. What the fuck? やがては巣立った子供たちが孫を連れて帰ってくる気づけば僕たちは大勢の子供と孫に囲まれた賑やかな老後を迎えてるだろうね。やつクレイジー。楽しそうです。ジョージさん、どんなおじいちゃんになって
I mean, you're dealing with Eva out of all people, so. But, I don't want to do that. 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 It is, your, it, is, it is finally time put up, put out, put out his past awkward notions and for him to become a man. I don't give a fuck about what, what uh, mother says. I will, I, I will, I will find a way to do so. Oh, he was already prepared? Oh, shit. I don't know about, you know, George dealing with his parents. I'm pretty sure there are a few that, you know, out there that in his family that could have and somewhat endorse it, so. George had said it aloud. So, Shannon said the same thing. I <laughs> wow, just like that. And oh god. What is Erica gonna say this time? もう恋愛ごっこ、お腹いっぱいなんですけど。はい、はい。私が首でも下すきに何かとんでもない伏線を通過されたらたまりませんから。お前には愛はないのか。<笑> Okay. Erica laughed coldly and stared down at the two on the game board. Badler watched her quietly. Erica thought she felt a touch of pity in his gaze, and she averted her eyes uncomfortably. Itchio are there any mystery novels that accept love as pr well, No, that's... Is that, I don't think it even matters whether it's, whether it's in a mystery novel or not. That This is... See, there are various sorts of like romance of notions that can be taken a bit of far. Like... like and <laughs> that's the thing, right? Like... When a relationship... When a relationship don't work out well or things... In the uh, or if a scenario can be taken a very bit too far, and you know, and you know what they, and you know what happens, they had no other choice but to, they but they made their decisions to either murder one, an either cause harm or to murder one another. That's the thing. Like it, it doesn't even matter if it's a mystery novel. It, I'm, it's it it really depends on the scenario. So I, so I I don't know what Eric like. Okay, Erica is a peak, is a game piece made by Burn Castle. Cool. Then I'm, I don't, I don't know if like Burn Castle making Erica or like inherit her like, you know, elitist behavior is like part of the plan. But it doesn't like, nah. I, I, I don't agree with the Erica's statement there. Like, any, any, you gotta really judge the scenarios of anything. So. 
赤くない言葉でいくら愛をささやこうとも全ては幻ですが<笑> So if Burn Castle doesn't have the fist or certain notion of love and Erica has really かわいそうになお前は魔女に証拠が与えられなかったら人も愛せないんだくだらない恋愛トークはやめてください私はあんたの敵であって恋の話に付き合う推挙な友人ではありませんから I mean what the fuck I don't know it's like what the hell like How can, how the fuck, how the fuck does romance even be, how is romance even a part of an illusion though? That's the thing. Like, are you saying like, you know, that's the thing, right? That the, the messaging within the wording is it always makes sense, right? Without love, it cannot, the truth cannot be seen or without love, you know, uh, yada, yada, yada. Like, that's just. Like, Erica only has, like, one certain emotion that she's only good at. That's just. And that's an ego. Like, when you're. You, I already know you're. Like, this game just written her to be, like, you know. To be, you know, hateable for the sake of it. So. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. あんたは何を悟ったってんです。あんたとベアとは罵り合い殺し合う関係だったはず。そのあんたが何の真相に至ってベアとに対する感情を変えたんですか？That's a good question. Even I don't know the uh, the hidden truth that even Balor knows to where he becomes like. まさか殺し合うライバル関係から恋愛感情が芽生えたとかバカなこと言い出さないですよねエリカ教ゲームの進行を続けさせましょう退屈な恋愛シーンなどとっとと終わらせるに限ります本当そうですね <laughs> no words. Shannon, this. 戻りましたうん今日の日誌はまだだなはいすぐに提出しますカノン君留守番をありがとう<笑>長い休み時間だったね Well, don't we all need a long break? Kanon had already noticed there was a sil silvery glint coming from the ring finger on Shannon's left hand. Genji disappeared off to the waiting room. After that, only Shannon and Cannon remain. Yeah, get, get out there. 
私たちは負けないよ僕だって負けるものか今日まで臆病でお嬢様にリードしてもらわなければ何もできなかった君が、oh. Shannon is a, has a very serious look on her face. Nay san ga oshie te kure ta hazu da yo. Nani wo oshie ta ka na? Well, what did we learn? What did you learn from today? Koi ni. Mukashi mo kako mo kankei nai. Ima dake ga juyou nan da te. Mo shi sore ga hontou nara. Boku no ima wa Nay san no ima ni. 何も負けてるなんて思わない。Yes, Canon. All your dumb shit you have done in the past is just immaterial. If I fix the one thing right now that matters. Shannon and Canon glared at each other with serious eyes. That period of tension vanished when Shannon chuckled. うん。それでいいよ。君と。お嬢様も頑張ってもしも結ばれるなら私たちが心の底から祝福できるくらいに素敵な関係になって姉さんにかなりのリードを許してるけどね仕方ないよそれが君のこれまでの臆病の対価なんだから分かってるそれが僕の罪だから Shannon and Cannon fished around in their pockets and drew out two small things that glittered gold They looked like the left and right wings of a gold butterfly 私たちは家具人間になって愛を育む奇跡を得るにはもう一度魔法の奇跡を頼らなくてはならない Rely on a miracle、uh. あいつのブローチが役に立つなんて、mm, debatable. 私たちの手元にある唯一の魔法It was the golden butterfly brooch, which Beata Ricci had once given to Shannon in the hopes of creating love between her and George. Shannon then gave it to Kenan, but he let his emotions get a hold of it and crushed it into pieces. So, when the two wings they held were brought together, it would remain, it would regain the form of a beautiful butterfly. Ja, eat the crew. Damn, Cannon bro actually broke the brooch? God damn. It's no wonder he had done stupid shit. No wonder Cannon had done stupid shit in the past. It's crazy. <laughs> but yeah, Ca but, e but even with Cannon, Cannon is still a kid nonetheless. <laughs> Canon left the servant room. He went to go see Jessica and tell her what he had determined to do. Shannon quietly watched him go. A fragment of the brooch and the engagement ring let off a gold and silver glint. Oh, Beato. Oh, other Beato. That's crazy. That 
That had been the first time that Beata Ricci, Witch of the Forest, had interacted with a human and given them her power. Bit by bit, she had transformed from a mere ghost to the ruler of the mansion at night. And by making the servants believe in her, she had wiped away the anti-magic power. Then, it eventually became possible for her to appear openly in front of Shannon, whose magic resistance had grown particularly low and who had begun to believe in the existence of Pieto Ricci. To Pieto, who had been unable to interact with anyone for many years, this conversation with Shannon must have been, must have been especially fun. <laughs> わらわは相当上機嫌であったのだな。わらわのごとき冷酷な魔女がそこまでサービスをするとは。でも素敵です。あなたは未来の恋人たちの中を取り持たれたのですから。もちろん甘やかしたつもりはないぞ。わらわの魔力を抑えつけてきたあの肉肉しい霊気を割ることと引き換えだそのおかげでわらわは一気に力を取り戻すことができたのだから。I don't know if that's I don't know if that's a bit of a disundere dialogue of it, but it I guess is a bit of a a trade offer. しかしある夜紫の雷が鎮守の社を打ち砕いたのです島々の者たちは強調だとささやき合いましたおお今思えばあれこそがベアトリーチェ様 a prelude to her resurrection. Damn. Well, we learned a lot of things, don't we? We are over an hour 20 minutes. I think this is a good place to end it here. No point of splitting the part off or anything like that. Just gonna upload it as is, because it feels like a very interesting segment. Oh, yeah, you know, we already know the pettiness from Erica of all things. <laughs> I don't know. Do I really have to? Am I really forced to pity her? I mean, this is a fucking, this is a game piece made by Burn, Burn Castle, even though she's technically a human. Imagine a human born with an ego. It's crazy, isn't it? Anyway. Well, aside of the uh, whole, you know, romance inside and all the love, such and such, the yada yada, uh, I will end it from here. So next part, let's continue the more of this um, interesting tale of the such. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Have a good one.